Welcome back, everybody, down to Legacy. I'm an old guy. Give me an end in this episode. We're going to go out and about and do another wasteland excursion um, with the primary goal of grabbing as much titanium as we can. Speaking of titanium, one of you guys pointed out to me in the comments that in the last episode I was saying that it's a one to one ratio uh, for titanium ingots, but it is a two to one. So I just miss, uh, miss that. So, yeah, thanks for pointing that out. But if you guys have been watching me for any length of time, you know math is not my strong suit. So there you go. Um, I also went ahead and made the sham chowder recipe and the vegetable stew recipe here uh, because I had those sitting in the research desk. And I still have the corn or the chili dog rather to make too. I figured I'd just bust those out. Um, you know, I'm not finding nail guns and um, impact drivers on a regular basis. <laughs> <laughs> and I am not going to upgrade the carpenter or the workbench, I should say, until I have a spare one of each one of those things. Um, so, uh, yeah, so I'm just going to, you know, spend my research points on other things that I need to do that with. So that includes sham chowder and veggie stew. Very good. Uh, now, let's see, can we make any of those right off the bat? Let's put a little bit of this in. Um, we can make sham chowder. Oh, yeah, we could make a whole mess of that. Uh, we're we're going to need some more water, though. So let's grab... Let's just turn half of these into water. I'm not sure how long that's going to take, but... 13 minutes. Okay. Oh. I guess I need more firewood in there. Do I have firewood in here? Oh, yes, we do. Let's grab half of that. Um, so, yeah, we're not going to, I'm not going to wait 13 minutes for that to make sham chowder. We're, we're fine on food. Um, I do need to probably, I, I need to start cooking some more stuff, though, just because. We're running out of room here in our fridge, uh, but we'll worry about that later. We got tons of meat, uh, too. But we have nine hobo stews with us, and we're in really good shape on food and water as it is. And I have three mineral waters there. Uh, why don't we pop just one of these to get nice and topped off on our hydration? And we'll put this in here. Okay, so I think we're ready to go. I've got six repair kits if we need them. Uh, we're in pretty good shape on ammo overall. You know what, though? We probably should take... Let's take another stack of 7.62s with us. Um, and little friend is fully repaired, so that's good. we got plenty of shotgun shells, plenty of snipers. We're good in good shape there. Uh, Valkyrie drill is fully repaired. And I have... Almost two, f and it should also be fully fueled up. Yeah, and then I have a, a couple of additional gasoline uh, cans there. Okay, I think we're good to go. Do you have anything in your inventory, Roberta? You don't. Okay, good. I think we're good to go. We got meds, and yeah, let's go. Uh, we're going to go get titanium. That is the plan, but we're also going to do some looting in the desert. Uh, not the desert, I'm sorry, in the wasteland, and... Probably get in lots of fights, because that's what happens in the wasteland, is you get in lots of fights. Let's see, what else for the comments? Uh, one of you guys suggested maybe using dart traps pointing down on the zombies as they're coming up the ladder. I like that idea, and that's something we might we may explore. Uh, we're not going to do that for, for this horde night, uh, but we might look into doing that, um, you know, in a future upgrade to the base so yeah that was a really good comment appreciate that and let's see what else uh, there was something else i can't remember what it was i did have another individual watching my very early videos and then offering a whole shit ton of unsolicited advice and telling me how to play but you know what that's just gonna happen <laughs> people are gonna do that and uh you know it is what it is Go down, bro. So, yeah, what we're going to do is we're going to be hitting, uh, salvaging the cars and looking for titanium nodes and looting. So, yeah, there are some major advantages 
to operating in the wasteland. I don't think I need to tell anybody what the disadvantages are. <laughs> but if you can, you know, if you're equipped to, to handle it, this is a the best place to get loot, man. And resources. I, I should, I should probably, yeah, you know what? We got some hackers. Let's take them. And I'm going to take Rockbusters when we find our first titanium loot. What do we got in here? See, look at that, man. That's good stuff. We got company. Incoming. Outgoing. Okay. Uh, that bear is moving close. There we go. That'll learn him. Get some testosterone extract off that dude if we ever... Oh, there's another one. If we ever want to make our own... Um, Steroids, which we might have to do at some point, since I seem to always be breaking my leg. Master, we are not alone. You too? Oh shit. Off of your head. We're calling in the cavalry. The zombie cavalry. You want a piece of me too? There you go. Well, actually, it's a piece of my sledgehammer. Okay. Now, uh, let's finish this car here. We've got a police car over here and uh, that guy. Come at me, bro. No, come at me, bro. There you go. There you go. I was trying to, I'm trying to remember what the other comment is that one of you left me. Oh, man, I can't remember what it was. It'll come to me at 3 o'clock in the morning, and I'll call you all up and let you know what it was. How's that sound? We're getting close to the water there. Okay, let's start looking for some titanium. Not necessarily going to hit every single car there is in our path. Uh, I don't think that's titanium. Oh, there's some. Incoming enemies, prepare for conflict. <laughs> Woohoo! Alright, is that dog coming? Yeah, he's pissed. Oh, look at that! <laughs> he killed the buzzard. Uh, oh, another buzzard. Wait, are you not dead? Seriously? Wow, man, I don't think I've ever seen a buzzard get knocked out before. Oh, shit! Is that what happened? Wow, I'm going to have to go back and watch that. I don't think I've ever seen a buzzard actually get knocked out before. I mean, you know, stunned and not... That was weird, dude. Really weird. Oh, I got a little story for you. Um, I went to the zoo, the Denver Zoo, on Tuesday. Wednesday? Tuesday. Uh, because my daughter works there. Um, some of you even know my daughter well. Virtually know her. Uh, Pix is her name. Uh, yeah, she's, she's a zookeeper there, and so my wife and I were coming back from Estes Park, Colorado on a little mini vacation, and we stopped to to see her and then have dinner with her and her husband. And anyway, um, there were, in, at the zoo, there were these uh, vultures. I'm trying to remember what the breed, the breed was, but there were these vultures, and they were like the biggest vultures in the world 
they had like a 10 foot wingspan and they were just enormous. They were so big. I couldn't believe how big those birds were. It's like, man, and it made me, made me think of seven days of <laughs> the vultures here that attack you all the time. I'm thinking, man, I wouldn't want that thing coming after me. Uh, all right, fat guy, are you going to come over here when we start doing our thing? Oh, we should probably reload our sniper. I, I think we're going to probably get his attention when we start drilling, so let's just deal with him right now. Right in the nuts. There you go. He did. Got another fat guy over there. And a ball sack up on the car. You get one in the balls, too. Okay. And let's... Where did ball sack go? Yeah, run at an angle and then run straight. There you go. Master, we are not alone. You don't say. Koparuski. Nope. Not allowed. Come here, dog. Off with your head. Okay. Let's go ahead and hit this titanium. We are going to take a Rock Busters. And we're going to take a coffee. Because we get the extra mining bonus for those two things. And let's see how much we get. Ten ore and one copper ore. Hmm. Okay. That's actually not a lot. I thought we'd get we would get more from those. Okay. Fair enough. Let's uh so, okay, see so we're at the all the way at this border. Let's look at the map for a second. Um yeah, why don't we go east? Let's go east. I went down and she went up. All right, let's loot this. There's some steroids. Yeah, I suppose at some point we might want to think about fixing up a, a four-wheeled vehicle. We'll get, you know, a lot more um, mobile storage that way, of course. That's really about the only advantage I can think of to do that. Now, knowing, I'm pretty sure in the vanilla game, the motorcycle is the fastest vehicle in the game. I don't know about Undead Legacy. Oh, we can't move. Okay. It is a pleasure to serve. Thanks. I'm glad you are pleased to serve because I've got some heavy stuff for you to carry. Let's give you all that. Uh, we have to watch her weight, too. Here, let's keep the pipes because we're going to be getting more of those. We'll give her the tools. We want to keep that stuff there. Okay, that's good. Oops. Let's check this car out. Okay. And we'll salvage. Going to get lots of good parts here. Okay, it was bugging me, so I had to look up. Um, there's actually two more comments I wanted to respond to. One of you said that that concrete barrier that I made, um, there is a shape menu like there is for everything else, and I might be able to, to change the shape of it so that it uh, would have a gap. So appreciate that comment. And then I had also mentioned uh, or pointed out that it looked like when I did the research for uh, whatever it was that we more recently researched, I can't remember what it was now, um, that it didn't consume the parts. I've got a bad feeling and about And you guys this. pointed out that... Um, it did consume the parts, and they just took them out of our, our pulled inventory rather than what's in our own inventory, which makes perfect sense. 
Uh, so yeah, those were the other two things. I, I knew they were sort of kind of important to, to mention. Uh, so that's why I wanted to look those up. So thanks guys for those comments. Really appreciate it. Hey, look, there's a safe right there. A safe and a Steve. And a military guy over there. All right, let's uh, open this sucker up. We'll use our lock picks and we will go counterclockwise. Look at that. Okay, we're one for one so far today. Metal spikes, Mom. All right, that's not bad. We'll take that. Uh, let's take out G.I. Joe here. <laughs> oh, can't take him anywhere. Um, one of the reasons why I'm often, uh, I often don't reload my sniper rifle is because a lot of times I'm shooting at something and it's closing on me and then I have to quickly switch to the shotgun or something and I just forget to go back and reload the sniper. So. At least we know why that happens. Off with your... Uh, yeah, attack the tree, big mama. Coochie shot. Okay, there's also a dog over here. Oh, there he is. He did. Uh, all right, so... um, Let's check this car here. Nothing in it. Okay, well salvage it yeah i guess uh i am gonna need to go back underground to mine titanium i was thinking we got more than just like 10 pieces from these surface nodes but apparently that is not the case where's my motorcycle it is right here it's a good thing that shows up on a compass i remember in the early uh days when we only had the mini bike in this game and it didn't show up on the compass Man, it was so easy to lose your mini bike. I mean, lose it to the point where it was gone forever. Well, it wasn't gone necessarily forever, but you just, you know, you never found it again, so you ended up having to make another My one. My senses have picked up something. So it's very handy to be able to see that on the compass. What you would do is you would um, hopefully get yourself in the habit of marking your mini bike on the map. You know, like put a little waypoint where it is. If you went off and, you know, started wandering away from it. So that way, you know, you knew where it was. But, you know, knowing me, of course, I didn't always remember to do that. So it was a bit of a pain in the neck. Let's see what's in the Phantom here. Okay. Useful stuff. Looks like we have about three minutes left on... Uh, no, that's not the salvage one. That's the, whatchamacallit one. The uh, mining one. Uh, I'll tell you what, let's see if we can find another, um, you know, a couple more, whatchamacallit nodes, titanium nodes, before that wears off. After we finish salvaging this car. Okay, we'll just drive around and look for some more. Enjoy the beautiful scenery here in the wasteland. There's some. Rattlesnakes and vultures. Master, we are not alone. Where are you? Oh, shit. Where's the snake? Uh... I don't see the snake. What happened to the snake? Didn't I kill it right here? Did I pulverize it? I must have pulverized it. They are very well camouflaged, after all. Oh, no, here he is. Okay. Um, Let's grab... Uh, let's down another coffee here. And where is the titanium? It's over here. 
tin. Oh crap. Is it just you two morons? Yeah, we're good. All right, let's take a one of these and keep looking around for some more titanium. We should have we should at least loot any cars that are lootable because that's how we get some really good stuff. But I'll probably ease up on the salvaging for now because we're going to at some point get uh over, you know, too heavy anyways. Oh, look, there there that's the titanium that I saw. I thought that was kind of weird that that other one was over there. Okay, fat guy's coming. And there's an, another titanium. I'm going to take one of these because our health is pretty low. Oh, crap. There's a bear right there. Did we get his attention? Oh, shit. Get out. Run the other way. <laughs> uh, where's my motorcycle? This would be a good time to not lose my motorcycle. Oh, there it is. Do, 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 do. Run away. Oh, shit. He's right there. <laughs> Me no likey bears. Especially those kind of bears. Is he still chasing us? Kind of dangerous here in the wasteland. We have an abrasion. Okay. Whew. That was a little intense. Get everybody reloaded. And let's actually I'm just curious. Let's let the let's let the coffee wear off and the mining uh rockbusters wear off and then see how much we get out of here. If it's still 10, you know, because we've consistently gotten 10 out of the three we've done so far. There's no point in taking that stuff and wasting it on this. I think we already looted this car, right? Yeah, we did. Did we loot this one? We did not. A scrap katana. Okay. You know, we found this um, super level uh, blade, saw blade, and I have not since come across a bladed weapon that's better than that. We've had that for a long time, too. This car is not lootable. Okay, is the coffee worn off? Yes, it is. All right, let's see if we get still get 10. Nope, we only got nine. Okay. Let's try it with just a coffee Master, we are not alone. and not a Rockbusters on the next one and see if we get 10 that way. All right, there's one over here by the bear. Oh wait, is that a... Get out of here! Off with your head. Lootable? Nope. Gotta have... Um, it has to have uh, seats in it. Ow. Okay. Got a buzzard coming in.
All right, let's uh, let's take another one of these. Because we got thumped good there. And let's have one of these. That'll give us a little more healing. And should take care of our food, but, uh, well, here, we're going to take a coffee only. Now, let's see if we get 10. Oh, we still only got nine. Okay, so I guess the question is, is it worth it to burn a Rockbusters to get one extra titanium? It probably is if all I'm doing is driving around and going for the titanium and not doing a bunch of other stuff, so we're maximizing our... Uh, you know, maximizing the buff there. So let's drive until we find the next titanium. And then we'll we'll pop the rock busters and then just keep keep moving and looking for more. All right, there's a titanium there. Two right next to each other. Look at that. Nice. All right, let's deal with the trash here. All right, ball sack's already... Look at that, man. One shot, one kill. Love it. Okay, I think we're clear here for the moment. So let's pop another Rockbusters. Oh, we need to... We need to lighten up here a bit, too. How may I assist you? Okay. Oh, hold on. We need to... We need to put some guns on you or something, Roberta. Can you weaponize the drones? I don't remember seeing a mod, uh, a mod for that. We are not alone. All good? All good. Okay, come here. All systems go. How may I help? Okay, you're at 129, and let's give you... That and that and that. Let's just scrap this stuff. Yeah, I know you can use radiators to make parts, but I already have a bunch of extra radiators back at the base. In case you were going to point that out. Uh, okay, let's go. Well, let's just keep moving because my rock busters are wearing out. We'll stay along, kind of along the shore here for the moment. Whoop. That bear just came right on out of the ground. He was resurrected. Guess that's what happens with zombies, right? Even if they're bears. Alright, I'm not spotting any more... No... <laughs> Kabloom! Any more nodes? My senses have picked up something. Oh, for Pete's sake. Are we good? We're infected. We can fix that. All right, come here, boys. Okay, let's move. Time's a wasting. Rockbusters are a wasting. Yeehaw! Where the heck are they all at, man? We find two next to each other, and now we can't find a darn single one. Ah, 
I guess, uh, it's safe to say that they're not abundant. I've got a bad feeling about this. Not as bad as they have. Do 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 there's one. Do 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 Come here, Fido. <laughs> I love it when they when they go flying like that. Do 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 Hey, just a, just a little shameless plug here. Some of you may not know that. Get out of here. You're pissing me off. Nurse Nancy? Have some buckshot. Have some more. Oh, have some more buckshot. You two. You three. Guys are relentless. And here comes another one. You did. Uh, all right, so back to shameless plug and also. Incoming enemies. You're still coming after me? There. Okay. Shameless plug time. <laughs> Um, some of you may not know that I, um, have been getting into simulator games a lot lately. And so I've been playing Gold Rush, I've been playing Farming Simulator, and I've been playing, uh, I just started doing uh, American Truck Simulator. So if any of you didn't know that and you are interested in simulator games, watching, watching him, um, yeah, check him out on the channel. I'd like to like to see you there. Oh, actually, you know what? Let's unlock this thing first. Okay, counterclock. Ooh. I should I could have used the lockpick. As soon as we get research enough research data, the very next thing on my list is we're two for two on going counterclockwise. Um is to make lockpicks. I have I have one ready to, to go. Um we just need the research data for it, so. Yeah, but anyway, come check it out. Um, just really thoroughly been enjoying the simulator games and probably will continue uh, to to play them uh, for the time being, if not permanently. And with that, I will conclude the shameless plug. And I'm not ashamed. It was shameless. Absolutely shameless. Let's check the cop car. Bad feeling about this. Um, actually, no, let's not. Let's go. We have four minutes left on Rockbusters. So we're just going to kind of keep skirting around, you know, near the coast here. Uh, is that titanium? Yeah, that's a titanium right there. That's not actually the one I was looking at, but then I caught it out of the corner of me eye. The corner of me eye! Okay, so it looks like we get tin without a coffee, so at least we don't need to consume a coffee. You did? Yeah, you did. Another snake.
Okay. Are we clear? Except for that buzzard? Oh man, that was some terrible shooting. Incoming enemies, prepare for conflict. I hit him in the hand. Died. There. We are in rough shape, including a broken arm. Seriously? <laughs> I did that miss. That was a freaking body shot, man. Okay, we are thumped really good. So, let's see here. I don't have a large medikit. Um, our... Yeah, we have a treated infection, so we're good to go there. Uh, we are going to need one of these. We're going to need one of these. You know what? The next time I come across a cast, I should probably do the blueprint on it because I am, I'm just getting banged up all the time, man. Uh, let's see. We have a concussion, so we need one of these. And I think we're back in reasonably good shape. We are going to need to drink now. And let's take another hobo stew, both for food and healing and hydration. Look at all those buffs, man. All right. And we're a bit on the heavy side. Let's go ahead and harvest you. I killed two snakes. I don't know where the other one is. Oh, here it is. Because we like snake meat. It's our favorite. Okay, we're going to need to start putting some stuff in here. Let's just, the titanium is getting heavy, of course, so let's put that in there. Uh, we don't need to carry two things of gasoline. I'm just going to start putting stuff in here based upon how heavy it is. We'll keep that there. Got a beef cut. That's great. Uh, we don't need that at all. Uh, we don't need this. Don't need that. And that's good enough. Okay. So we have 17 seconds left on our current Rockbuster buff. Okay. What time is it? Oh my goodness. It's it's time to wrap things up. <laughs> it goes by when you're having fun, doesn't it? Yes, indeed. But, um... It is well worth it to come out here and do this, of course. And it's fun and entertaining and all that. My but have up it really isn't an efficient way to get titanium. I, I guess I was thinking for some reason we would get more than we have been getting. All right, we got that bear's attention. Let's give us our, ourselves a little bit of distance. Make sure everybody's loaded here. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to go back to underground mining uh, to get titanium in quantity. Yeah, stay stuck on that tree. We good? Okay, let's go over here and grab this one. There is a bear right over there, so we have to watch out for him. Um... No, we don't need to go in there. I've been in that POI before anyway. All right, you guys. Well, I think we're going to have to wrap things up here. I'm going to... we are not alone. I'm probably going to stay out here. What what time of day is it? It's 15.30? Yeah, I'm probably going to stay out here for the rest of this in-game day and just grab as much of this as I can. And then... um. This is kind of an interesting little peninsula out here. And let's see, what are we going to do in the next episode? We'll probably... 
Well, we'll, we'll probably finish the horde base um, because it's still waiting for you know, more titanium upgrades. But we'll do that. And uh, then we'll probably just go, I don't know, do some looting or something. So, yeah. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. See ya. Yikes.